Welcome back to Valerie's Vanity. This is going to be a get ready with me video like never before. I'm going to a 2000s party tonight for one of my best friends 23rd birthday and shout out to Carrie. Happy birthday. And it is 2000s theme and I have been so excited. So before I begin my makeup look, I'm going to show you what I have on. So this is literally like a blue sequin tank top and it's not the most comfortable thing to be honest but this is like perfect because people wore crap like this in the 2000s and you know it's actually kind of cute so <laughs> I don't hate it you know and then obviously they didn't like I mean I don't know about the short situation but I just wore it with black shorts and then of course the Chanel necklace and my mini Louis Vuitton purse with a flip phone, of course. And the best part is, shout out to you if you remember these babies right here. The super thick sandals. These are crazy dirty. These were my cousins and she gave them to me and I thought they were like the coolest thing ever. And I'm rocking these tonight. So this is going to be so much fun and I'm so excited. So in the 2000s, this era of time, it was a time where literally people just, they just threw on that bronzer. Nowhere specific. They just wanted it all on. And it looks like I have no shirt on. Hold on. Okay. Anyways. <laughs> and there was hair crimping. There was um, blue eyeshadow, silver eyeshadow, glitter eyeshadow. And it was all over it. There was no blending, no, you know, specific lines. It was just there. Look it up. I'm, I swear I'm not making this up. So today we are going to be playing with some colors that I've probably never done on Valerie's Vanity before because we've never had a reason to. So I am thinking I'm going to do blue with these. I found these wet and wild mega sparkle loose glitter to put on top because that's like legit probably from straight up like 2000s. <laughs> that's how long I've had that. But we are going to do some blue eyeshadow never and oh oops okay anyways anyways so it's going to be in this claire's palette because i feel like in 2000s they weren't using tarte they weren't using you know jacqueline hill morphe whatever they were they were rocking the claire's the wet and wild just the literally just the brands that you know whatever because makeup wasn't like a big thing like it is now I feel like YouTube has played a big part in that and the makeup industry has just grown so much in the last I don't know five years ish well I shouldn't say five probably like ten. I don't know I started getting into it probably like two or three years ago but anyways as always we're going to start off with eye primer I know they probably didn't use eye primer back then because they didn't care what happened they just wanted to look fly and yeah but I'm using eye primer because I do want this um eyeshadow to stay for my party I'm going to <laughs> okay so now we've got our eye primer on and whew, it's hot in here <sighs> okay I think this my hair is like all on my back Ugh. okay if you have long hair, you know the struggle. All right. Ooh. This palette smells weird. Is that bad? <laughs> it stinks. Is that bad that I'm going to use this on my eyes if it smells? Does that mean it's like expired? Oh, well, we're doing it. We're going for it. Because I need the, I don't have these color, some of these colors. They also wore white. So, I don't know, maybe we should do white since I have on a blue shirt. Or, you know, we'll just throw it all together because apparently they just didn't give a crap in the 2000s. They just wore whatever. So, if you were a teenager during this time, I would love to see comments of things that you wore or did or whatever because I just think it was just so funny, like, some of the styles. But, hey, that was the style. I mean, even Paris Hilton and all the big stars wore those things. So, so let's see oh man it's so hard to like not do what i would normally do 
with a palette like this. <coughs> I just got a whiff of it again. But I think I'm gonna go in with this light blue color. Oops, not that one, this one. And just put that baby on all over. Yes, work. Okay, that one's not that noticeable. Let's use a different brush. <laughs> I'm gonna use a darker blue. <laughs> yes, honey. Hot. Okay. Isn't didn't Paris Hilton like try to like make hot like her word or something? I'm pretty sure she did. Yeah, yeah, work it. Okay. Like I said, there was no blending. It was just putting the straight color on like so and I think I'm actually should I go even darker with this blue I kind of feel wild like if I'm gonna go all out like I need to go all out you know what I'm saying <laughs> oh my gosh this is so funny usually in makeup videos I'm like so precise and like so worried I'm gonna mess up so I love just slapping this crap on and like not caring at all ah! Oh my gosh, oh, that's so funny. I have not worn, <laughs> sorry. I kind of want to, ooh, let's do this blue. I'm sorry, I just realized I'm like chomping my, chomping my gum in this video. Oh, work. <laughs> yes. Okay. Think that's enough blue or do we need more? Mm, let's do a little bit of this color. <laughs> Just like layering these colors on top of each other. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. I like bit my eyelashes down. <sighs> okay, so we've got this eyeshadow on. Looking cute, looking fly, okay. And you know, let's just for the freaking heck of it, put some white eyeshadow on too. Cause I always remember my cousin wearing like white eyeshadow. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, now I don't know how to get this to stay, the glitter. I don't remember, I wonder how they did it back then. Cause it's like straight up loose glitter. How would they have gotten that to stick? I don't know. I think I'm just gonna literally take this brush, dip it in, and just put it on and let the litter, glitter, the glitter fall where it may. <laughs> Good thing I already went to the store because I definitely had to go like shopping today to get her a birthday present. Okay, I feel like this is how glitter gets in your eye though. Shit, I'm gonna have glitter all in my eye. Ugh. Dang it. I should have, even though they didn't back then, I should have done some sort of like a, oh well, it'll be okay, it'll be all right. Okay, I feel like we should like make use of this glitter. Like I need more glitter everywhere because I feel like glitter was a big thing. I'm gonna use this Party Stick Silver Ice Shimmer Balm from Pink. And I'm just gonna <laughs> Okay, rub that in my arms. I don't know if you can tell. Look at my tan line, I just noticed it. Dang it. Oh. You can hear my husband mowing the grass. Can you see it? Cute. I should just leave it like this. I don't think they did that in the 2000s. Gotta get that glitter though. And then maybe I'll put the loose glitter on top since that's like kind of sticky. I need a bigger brush. <laughs> yeah, yes, okay, okay, okay. So now we got this on. I'm gonna just spice up the night with this. My husband, I don't think like he's nearly as excited as I am about this theme. So watch us stay for like an hour 
and then I'll have all this crap on me. I'm, I think I'm gonna regret this whenever I'm trying to like get it off of me, whenever I'm like getting ready tonight. My husband hates glitter. <laughs> Sorry, Tyler. Okay. Yeah, okay, can you see that? Work, work, okay. <laughs> okay, so we've got our glitter chest and arms going for us. And I feel like we should add some bronzer to the party. I'm just gonna use my Pacifica 100% vegan and cruelty free bronzer. Oh, I feel like this glitter is getting all in my eye. Okay, and then I'm just going to use this Jaclyn Hill brush with Morphe and put some bronzer on. Because everybody loved bronzer in the 2000s. Everybody in the club. I feel like this bronzer isn't going to be bronze enough though. Plus, for some reason, my vanity lights make me look a lot lighter than I am in real life. And it's really annoying. I think because they're white lights. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's see. Hopefully, Tyler doesn't want to, like, go out to dinner or something after. Because I'd be looking like this. And people be like, girl, you're stuck in the 2000s. And I'd be like, ah, that's the point. Okay, you put some blush on. Um, I don't think highlighter was a thing in the 2000s, so I don't know if I'm gonna go there, but mm -hmm. I mean, we could, because it's still, you know, 2019. So let's do it. Let's put some of my Artist Couture highlighter on. Wait, this is what I use for the glitter. We'll use my not that one. We'll use my Jaclyn Hill brush. Highlight those cheekbones. Yeah, it's good. Okay, so we are ready for the party. Oh, almost forgot. The lips were a big deal. So, when in, when in 2000, instead of when in Rome, it's when in 2000, you wore nude lips. And it didn't matter. It just needed to be the whitest, nudiest, shiniest, not like nude lip like now, like pinky nude like this. This is Twinkle, and this is CoverGirl. This is probably like what everybody had. Okay, I feel like it could even be more nude than that, but. Ooh, I know, we'll put this Lip Smacker gloss over it. I'm gonna regret this later when we're in the car with the windows down. Oh my gosh. This stuff smells so good. Like this was, this these were the brands. Like Lip Smack or Wet n Wild, some CoverGirl, you know. That was it. I don't think they were using pink party sticks, but oops. Did that actually? It literally landed right where I was gonna put it. That's crazy. Okay, so obviously with the hair, I already did that. I just have um, the double braid and the like pigtails by girl type thing going on and that's just gonna stay in the back like that and my hair is a little like crimpy or whatever which was totally the look and I feel like that's everything we need for the freaking 2000 party I can't think of anything else but thanks for getting ready for with me I I'm so excited. I feel like a little kid, like, oh my gosh. This is how my cousin like wore her makeup and I thought it was so cool. So I was going to get some like purple mascara, but I didn't have time. So 
hopefully somebody else will do that. I will be posting pictures on my Instagram most likely. So look below for my Instagram handle. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.